Yo, yo, what is up everyone? There's no portal, but there's Tom Kench and look, everyone started the game with basically 30 gold. I think I'm gonna go buried treasure here. I have gold, I just need components. So I'm, I'm pretty happy to click buried treasure. Uh, belt is fine. Slam the Shojin. Um, I think we're just gonna play towards like Zyra reroll or something. I have a lesser dupe. It's gonna help me out a lot. Probably sell the Yas, play towards Story Weaver then. I'm not even gonna level four here. I mean, honestly, maybe I should, but I'm making 50. Like, I'm, I make 50 next turn if I don't. I just have to sell one, which is fine. I can just sell Rek'Sai. How good is it? It's good. Like that, like, as well starting with gold's pretty crazy. Honestly, like, stuff like Clear Mind's really good. Learning to spell, that's fine. I mean, I think Buried Treasure's probably, like, insane. Because we're all gonna be rich, but... Like, having items is pretty important as well. I would have loved to play a level 3 guy here. Maybe killed one. But because I played level 4, I don't kill any. Maybe we can look to get Exalted in. Ari, Cho'Gath, and Mumusaraka. It's like okay. Can't make Econ here actually, so we're gonna level. We're gonna level and play AP here. Fine with me. Can't make Econ anyway, so I may as well pump it. Like we're we're gonna make um nine gold next turn anyway, so it's whatever. Probably just stick stick to rerolling the Zyra. Everyone's gonna cap pretty high because there's a lot of econ. But if I can hit the Zyra board pretty early, we just save a lot of HP. Some people will roll at six though, as well. So it's not great for me. A sword. I don't love sword here. Probably would have preferred bow or rod, but it's okay. Probably going for bow after this. I mean, this can always be a second Shojin. Put it on Zoe. So it's not that bad. I mean, honestly, I should probably be playing Kabuko. For a little. In case I hit Kabuko too. I feel like Lucky Pause is a free win this patch. Like, kind of. Not really a free win. I think if you high roll the units, like the Kabukos, it's really good. I wouldn't say it's a free win, though. Look at this guy. 95 HP. And his board's, like, just a little better than mine. Good loss for me. It's a really good loss, honestly. I want to take Bow or Rod here. Bow Alawi is complete best for me, but I doubt I get it. Oh wow, that is complete best. That is crazy. That is crazy for me. Well, bless up this guy for taking Rod. Bless this guy. I don't know what, what he wants from Rod, but... Or maybe he's playing Bard Reroll. He just needs two bows from here. Hello, yo, so that'd be nice to see you. Actually, I guess it makes sense. You need Spark, Morello, etc. Gonna slam the Nashes. Definitely not bad. Exalted is Shiraka. Please in. Would be good to get the Aatrox in. So our final, our level 6 board's gonna look something like this, right? Um, Blaui, Zoe, 2, 4, 6. I guess we'd probably play maybe something over Shen. Maybe a Warden. Alright, that's a really great spot for Cog reroll. He gets to roll just every turn. Keep his board strength going. Can you explain low roll and high roll? Low roll is just when you get unlucky. High roll is when you're getting lucky. That's the, the context people use it in. If you're high rolling, you're getting good luck at the game. 
Hey Tom, looking like me, wishing you... Wishing you got back to 1k LP on a good run. Thank you. I hope so too. I hope so too. And the view bottom. Nice. <laughs> uh, we're paired. We're decent pairs here. Just need the Zoe over Sivia and then um, probably play Aatrox next level. I'll be my board for a little. Just scout if anyone else is playing Zyra. I don't think we are contested. Yeah, it's just fully open for. Yeah, I don't think we are contested at all. That's good for me. Probably gonna slam armor crit on my Shen. Or a Lowy, we'll see. I have a lesser dupe, which is really good. It's a shame we won this round. Honestly, uh, our econ would be better without it. Without winning there, but it's okay. I think no point not leveling here. Sell, sell. Shen. One Aatrox in here. And then we're looking for Riven. Zoe. Sell the Jax, probably sell the Janna. He's getting pretty close to Cog 3 already. It's a little scary. You know, I see it's a really good spot to play Cog, so fair enough. Emma. Belt. A lot of belts. I mean, it's probably Warmog's Gargoyles, but you don't love it. I'm gonna roll a little deeper here. Target Get my two stars, ideally. Never a dull moment. Can I get four ghostly in? Not really. Burdens of the past. Our wills align. Well, that's fine for now. I'm gonna slam items on Shin. Okay, nice. That's a good win. I mean, honestly, there's a bit of an argument to rolling at seven. I think I will probably roll at 7 instead now. Tier 3 is not that important to me. I mean, honestly, healing orbs is pretty good. Let's go healing orbs. Morg is crazy. Uh, after Carousel, I'm going to go 7, and then I'm going to keep rolling at 7. I really wanted Zyra 2, though. To not have Zyra 2 is a bit of a rough one. So level 7, I'm going to play Morg, Zoe, and then we're sorted. I mean, honestly, there's a bit of an argument to roll to like 30 here. Give me my Zyra, please. I don't really want to use dupe, that's the problem. I probably should, but I really don't want to. Like, duping Zyra saves me a lot of HP here. I mean, honestly, we have a lot of units. Just my econ's a bit tough at the moment. There's definitely an argument to, like, not rolling so deep as well, but I really needed the Zyra too. Alright, we're duping Zyra. Unless I just swap items onto Zoe. I mean, honestly, let me see if Zoe's contested, because Zoe 3 is actually better for sure. I want contested Zoe. Let's go. Okay, now we go up. I'm going to sell an Aatrox. Go for Shen 3 only, probably.
Yeah, I think this is stable enough for this stage. We get our Morgan. We'll be chilling. I mean, it might even level up to Carousel, honestly. Healing Orbs is good. I see helps me a lot here. It just keeps my front line alive. Nice. Good win. Gonna go seven up to carousel. I want rods here, ideally. I need I need um spell crit. I also need spark. If not rod, probably MR. Or Shojin for Zyra. But I think we need to go for a spell crit here. Like the spell crit component. This guy's teched in fortune. Dude, he's gonna have the most insane board ever. It's good we're saving HP. It's really good. Okay, four ghostly in is good. Four ghostly in is really good. Now we just itemize Morg. I'm just gonna be at seven rolling for ages. Keep the lesser dupe for Zoe 3. Hopefully we win these rounds, they're important rounds. Ooh, he has a Lydia. I mean, honestly, I'm playing him on a round where he's not that strong yet. So hopefully we win it. This guy's gonna roll like 60 gold at 8. He's so rich. With what doesn't kill you. Not enough to make Econ here, and I don't want to sell the Shen. Shen 3 is definitely an angle. Okay, severe move speed. Nice. <laughs> I love the little thumbs up. Yeah, I mean, this guy's literally going to win the lobby. This guy's cashing. Isn't he cashing an insane fortune stack? 16 and he's full health. So we just play around that. Care for the Kiana here. I mean, the Kiana is pretty strong into me, honestly. I should probably actually stack this side. Ooh, focus at everything. This could be bad for me. He's also got a D-Claw. Shop's crazy for Kaiser, yeah. Kaiser, Volley Bear, Silas. Not a bad shop for Kaiser. I mean, this guy's so strong, by the way. Like, unbelievably strong. We win this when we hit Shen 3, Zoe 3. It's really rough that we played him this rotation. I, I needed to streak into Wolves. I think I rolled too much gold, honestly. We have to get good RNG now. So that we can hit. Now we need good RNG on the Zoe and the Shen. To, to get back into the game. If I didn't play him and I played someone I beat, we'd be so solid right now. This guy's level like everyone's gonna be level 8 rolling 50 gold. I, I needed to streak this whole stage. Need rods here. No rods. I mean, it's a little rough. Not much I can do, though. I might have to slam IE. Oh, my crit. I like it more. And then go for Spark, I guess. And maybe this can be adaptive. Because next MR has to be Spark anyway. Mm 
Okay, we just need to get the Ghosty Spectre stacked. Oh, not enough damage, man. Yeah. I mean, unfortunately, this guy hit his two-star Silas. He didn't hit two-star Syndra, but... Ghost the Emblem and Shen. Heavy hitters. I like heavy hitters. I'm not in the bracket yet, though. The thing with Ghost the Emblem and Shen is... It's not good till next level, to level 8. But I guess I could go 8. And play Kane or Caitlyn. I like heavy hitters here. I like combat casters here. I like Ghost the Emblem here too, honestly. Okay, let's do it. I think we need some kind of future. Also, it just gives me Shens. Not buying that. I think I'm gonna roll for Shen here. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. Okay, honestly, I think we have pretty good RNG on those rolls. Can't complain. This guy just has really good ways of getting through my comp. One, two, three. Oh, what a win. What a win. Huge win. One KLP today. Hopefully. Hopefully. I mean, if we hit Zoe Chen, we're chilling. We're legit chilling. Need to keep an eye out for a Kane and a Caitlyn. Caitlyn. Kane. Zoe. Shen. I might dig 20 here. If I see a Shen, I'll probably dupe it. Actually, you know what? I'm actually going to Econ till neutrals. Now. Because I make 30, 40, 50, hopefully. And then I roll down after neutrals and then hopefully find Zoe and Shen. Then I can save my dupe as well for the one that I I need to play. I mean the IE is obviously sub suboptimal, but you gotta do what you gotta do. It's a great win if we win this. Nice, that's a huge win for me. Honestly, a huge win. Okay. That's massive. That's actually massive. Zoe, I would take a Zoe and slam BT, honestly. And the next rock can just be Spark. Like, getting a Zoe is pretty big for me. Oh, a Spark is bigger, though. It's only if Rod doesn't go. Spark is definitely bigger. Spark is definitely bigger. The thing I'm scared of is that I don't want my Spark to die. So actually, if I can find Shen, like Shen in shop or something, it would be huge for me. Okay, here's the plan. I think the plan is double Shen with Spark. And then when we find Shen 3, we can just keep the Spark on Shen. I think that's the plan. Need to keep this. These are all important. Okay, this guy's fortune cashing in three. He's gonna cash just the fattest cash in the world, man. And then the little bee is in trouble. Okay, I mean, what a rotation to play this guy. How much HP is he? 29. Bro, this guy's cashing, let's be honest. He's cashing in... Bro, that guy is cashing the fattest cash out in the world. <laughs> He's cashing like 120. Jeez. Okay, I mean, bottom left, bottom right. All the carries are in the corners.
Okay, his spark, I mean, his ship is not hitting right now. My Zoe is gonna die, though. I was gonna say, on the bright side, his ship was Zephyr'd. Get, get a couple more. Okay, not bad, not bad, not bad. Remember, our big spike is after this. How much he's taking? 16. Okay, so he needs to take 18 next turn. I mean, that's pretty improbable, no? I can't win. <laughs> it's okay. You got this. You got this. Yeah, I need two Zoe's and one Shen. Uh, three Zoe's and one Shen. So technically, I need four of four of them total. Four of anything total. Maybe two Shens, two Zoe's, for example. A rod. Not bad. Nice. Big, big for me. Big for me. Big for me. Just one Shen. Give me a Shen. For you. Give me a Shen. Please. I have to dig here. Nice. Our wills Keep the Shen. Target I didn't. I, I'm trolling. I'm trolling, but it's fine. I'm trolling, but it's fine. Morello. No Morello. Um, adaptive Helm, probably. I trolled that so bad, by the way. I meant to take the spark, take the Shen with spark off. I forgot. I forgot. I did the thing I said I wouldn't do. Oh gosh. Okay, big win, big win. It's gonna be 28 to level. Wait, he lost. He actually lost, by the way. He took 18. Alan saved the lobby. Alan saved the lobby. The goat. Okay, I'm glad we took the ghostly emblem, man. Alan legit saved the saved the lobby. My goat, dude. I love that guy. Alan said Q, the absolute legend. Absolute legend. I slammed adaptive on um, Zyra, not Morg, because Zyra actually has inbuilt anti-heal. And Morg is Morg 1. If it was Morg 2... Honestly, I still probably wouldn't slam it. I need Morello so bad. Like, I need anti-heal so bad that like I probably still wouldn't slam it. Yeah, I mean, this IE Zoe might actually save me this game. Zoe 3 is a crazy unit, and my augments are good. I'm telling you, Zoe 3 is, like, insane. I'm glad I slammed IE. I was doubting myself a little. Huge win. Absolutely massive win. This is the thing, the Cog guy hit so early, he hit everything, and he's level 9, and he's still losing, because Cog just sucks, man. It just is what it is. Not much he can do to that. It's not much counterplay. Ooh, would it be nice to hit one of the two stars? Two star Kane's like not even bad, it just gives me a lot of HP. I'm gonna move the Shen here. I gotta be really careful for the Lilia. I think the Lily is actually hitting me, which is not great. Oh, actually, yeah, it does. The angle is too good. Oh, no, it doesn't. It's, it's perfect. The perfect angle. Yeah, I'm so strong. I'm so unbelievably strong. Zoe 3 is so nuts, man. I'm telling you, this unit is so insane. This unit is so crazy. I got good RNG on the Zoe's because I kind of ruined my econ early game. We got good RNG on the Zoe's, I, I will not lie. No anti-heal, right? No anti-heal. There is King 2. King 2 is gone. I mean AP, just general AP is good. Something for Zyra maybe. Play with um, Seraphs would be fine. It's okay. Could have also denied GA and put it on Kane, I guess. Not a bad idea. 
I'm going to make a randomizer roulette with all the good comps right now. Whichever it lands on, I'm hard forcing. <laughs> Maybe that's a way to climb? Perhaps? Do you think I get to 9 this game, team? Honestly, I think I have a chance. Okay, for me to win this, I need to kill the noob units. Let's just say right side then. I have good odds into this guy. I'm spe stacking the Spectres really well and he's wrong side for me. Honestly, I'm pretty surprised this guy didn't take Mythic Spat. Dude, look at the Spectres. It's so insane. So insane. I guess I hold way. I didn't even slam my Seraphs. <laughs> we don't talk about it. We don't talk about it. I should also slam this rod. Alan actually positioned perfectly for me. Guys, kind of good at the game, I guess. Would make sense. Did he get it? He actually got correct side too. It's a good no ult from this guy. My spark's gonna die. My spark's dead. I need healing orbs procs on this Shen now. Not enough, not enough. Can we go 9? That is the question. I mean, honestly, even if I go 9, is there anything to hit? Not that much, honestly. I haven't seen the Reaper Bruiser comp in Chal yet. Normally, it's actually really popular. It was played a lot in the tournament recently. It's a really good comp. TG is fine. Two options here, roll for Kane 2 or go 9. I think 9 is way more reliable, so we're going 9. I need my spark to not die. He's actually going to kill my spark unless it hits Riven. Okay, hit Riven. He might wrap me here. Could be bad. Oh. Healing orbs. Oh, good healing. Healing orbs. Oh. Tough fight for me. Tough fight for me. 72. I have to win next. I think the only way I win next is if I'm correct side. I think we just flip it. He just has double on. He just has double on, man. My spark's dead. Okay, I think we lose it here. It's a fourth. It's a fourth. Honestly, I'll take a fourth. Okay, it's not that bad. Dan and Wukong for nine sage. Yeah, I actually probably level nine would have been another sage. GG everyone, thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, remember to like, comment, subscribe. You guys are the goats if you made it this far. Thank you.